Good morning. My name is Layla Harris and I am from CraftyLayla.com and this morning I want to show you how to make the stickers work really well for a shadow box kit. For this project we have a lot of our stickers that are elevated with 3D foam tape so that they have a nice effect. But unfortunately with a sticker, if you were to push down on it, it would stick down and you would have a rippling effect, especially with these little smaller pieces. We don't want that to happen and we want our project to look nice for years to come. So we have a little technique that is frustration free to remove the sticky off the back of the stickers. I'm going to use these stickers here that are left over from a few years back to show you. Just peel the sticker off and have a bowl of cornstarch at hand. You can use baby powder or the cornstarch. I prefer the fragrance free variety. And you can brush it on or you can drop it in the bowl and then just brush it off. Use a, a fluffy brush that will um, has a little action to it to get the cornstarch off. And it's no big deal if you get it on the front. Our products don't like to hang on to that cornstarch. They don't stain. Even our black comes clean. After that, you can apply some 3D foam tape. And I will say for a card, I would probably just put a couple pieces. If this was for the 3D sh shadow box, I would put a lot on it because I don't want anything to crush it and bend it for years to come. So it really depends on what your project is going to be, how much 3D foam tape you're going to use. So since this is going to go on the card, I probably will just put a triangle of 3D foam tape and that, and you can cut it any way you want. These stickers are our non-stick scissors and they are great for cutting foam tape because they don't gum up. So that's how we remove the adhesive. It's not actually removing, we're just kind of killing it. I don't know what you want to call it, but it's no longer sticky. It's nice and smooth and it's going to be great for your shadow box.